What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Good afternoon, good morning, benvenue, como estas, buenos noches, and all the guten tags out there. Today, this is uh, Mr. W, and we're going to talk about uh, the same topic we're going to talk about for a couple weeks now, coming up in three, two, one. We're going to talk about variations of the, bam, the, the mig toe lifestyle. And what I'm gonna talk about today is I'm gonna talk about the United Simps of America. Now you'll see these guys, and, you're, and I'm, gonna, I'm gonna explain something. This thing has levels to it. Now you'll have you'll have these like I, one time I had on my Facebook. I didn't talk well in a way I did talk about, but I didn't say MGTOW specifically. But in, in, in a post, like I see young men out here falling into the same trap, and I told them quit falling for these old ass women to get all these kids to model dudes. No, a couple of women got offended by that, and then they were telling me, you know, well, I have a young man, this, that, and the and uh, he can't keep up with me. Number one, what I wanted to say is, there's levels to everything. The only reason you're keeping, I want to tell this chick, the only reason that you're keeping that guy at your house is, he's not, one, he's not paying for anything. Two, he can leave anytime he wants to. He got a free roof over his head, he gets free food. Like I said, don't compare him to a regular guy who has priorities in life. Because the regular guys don't want you. So let's, let's, let's move away on that. But back to the lecture at hand. I'm talking about the simps. Now these guys, what they'll do is, every post a chick makes, they'll agree with them 100%. They'll agree whatever they say 1,000%. If you say something against this chick, he'll have some type of comeback. Say like, what well, they'll say is this chick fat. You'll say, the obvious people... Everybody knows what fat looks like, but then a simp will say something to cover that up. Say a chick will say, say, say you go on a Facebook, and I, I've seen this in the group before. And you chick will post, you think I'm fat, and say I say yes, which obviously she is. If I say yes, a guy will come back to say underneath my, he'll reply to me, "Would you still fuck her?" I'm like, well, number one, that wasn't the question. Number two. Depending on my state of drunkenness, and if nobody knows about it, she might get it. I'm not. As I said that's not the that's not the issue. The issue is if she's fat or not. And yes, she's fat. Cause you you know what these guys do? These guys think that they can uh, get in these chicks' inboxes, and they know who to pick. They pick they pick the chicks that you turn down. And then what happens? Every once in a while, these chicks that they turn down turn them down, and then these chicks that turn them down think they got to show up with us. I'm like. You're not my first pick, sweetheart, you know. If there's no other women on earth and it's between you and a gay dude, well then you're 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 uh you're attending to me right now. But that's not the choice I have right now. I have many choices out there and you are nowhere near my first round draft pick. You are you you're basically the, the last pick that gets to go to Disney World, so enjoy it. But the fact remains about these Sims is they'll come up here and rescue these chicks. They'll try to fight with you. They'll get mad at you. They'll call you all sorts of names. They'll basically do the same thing a chick does. Except that they have male parts, I'm assuming, because they, they're, they're, they might be a, a transformer, so I don't know. But they'll, 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 they're hoping these chicks will say they'll sleep with them. They, they'll do it for a whiff of pussy. That's the bad part about it. They'll do it just for a picture. Send me a pic of you naked, yo. I'll, I'll tell you to get you up in the game. I mean, it, to me, it's just a shame. And, like, a lot of women don't understand there's different levels to this. You can tell this, like, like it's usually the ugly chicks will t have these names like pretty, beautiful, sexy, thick. I'm like, if these names all apply to you, why are you still single? Or chicks say, well, I'm a lesbian. I said, well, if you're a lesbian, why are you going with a lesbian who dresses like a man? I thought that's what something you don't want to have. Why would you want to have a second-rate something? Why are you going to dumb yourself down or lower yourself to that? I said, and this is why I'm telling males to stay 
clear, you women, because you don't know what you want. And then you guys come around at age 40 or 50 when you have no kids, and you got to turn into the crazy cat lady. Then all of a sudden you want to come around and say, maybe feminism is no good. You think? By then you're washed up. Well, usually the single ones are washed up in their 50s with no kids, 40s and 50s. And the ones nowadays, whoo the wall is unkind. These, these motherfuckers nowadays are hitting the wall at 20s, in their 20s. And you know, you guys know I'm talking the truth because you see these females. All you gotta do is go on Facebook and look at their pictures and you're like, like, every once in a while I'll mess with these chicks. I'll say, they'll say, how old do you, they'll say, how old do I look? I'll tell them, you look good for 45. Well, I'm 30. I'm like, oh, sorry. You know, I'm just snickering and laughing, but cause it's, well, to me it's funny. But then you'll have, like I said, they'll have these simps come out here and defend her. Oh, she looks like a 10 to me. You know, like she got like three eyeballs, you know. She got she got more chins than the Shanghai phone book. I mean, it's just, it's just, it's, it's funny that these, these simps are always backing them up. And they're always trying to tear you down and make it like, like, we getting points off of the internet. I mean, I, if you want to talk, talk with me all day, I don't care. But I'm like, buddy... You don't have nothing to worry about. I'm not trying to do anything over this chick for you. If you want her, if your back can take her, go ahead. Your back can't, back can't take it, I wouldn't bother. So this goes out to you, the United Simps of America. The guys are always trying to rescue a cat in every fucking tree. A guy is trying to lay down your coat over a puddle of mud so these, so these stupid bitches can walk right over top of it. First of all, that is the dumbest thing I ever saw, too, so I'll have to address that later. But to you simps, put your capes on. And quit, and quit every time somebody makes a comment you don't like about a chick. Don't quit. Well, well, you, you'd mess with her. You, you, you take sex from her. Well, I'm a male. Why wouldn't I? I mean, I, she may not be my first priority, but like I said, if it's between her and... You know, a male, I'm going for the female. I'll let you have the male. So, this is another video, and I hope you enjoyed it. Just remember, the key points are there are levels to everything. And like I said, a lot of, you got to learn that, like, just because she's single and ugly, there's always some dirty bastard out there willing to hit her. And that's what these chicks don't understand. They, they want to they wanna compare these simps to you, and you got to let them know from the gate, look, man. I'm not a simp. You you deal with these type of guys because you have no choice but to deal with these type of guys because guys like us don't want you. I have options to deal with women in my life because I have options. And that's what you young boys want. You want to have options in life where you don't have to deal with these fat, ugly, nasty chicks. You want to deal with chicks who you want to deal with. Let the simps deal, let the simps deal with, with who they have to deal with. There's a difference between have to have to and want to if you want to deal with them fine that's good but that's your will you can do it don't make yourself be in that category where you have to deal because when you have to deal with something you got to eat a shit sandwich every day and look at that in the mirror and you got to know that there's people there laughing at you that you had to resort to something like that now, and i know people are gonna get mad at me and say oh well it ain't about the how they look yes it is you're drawn by your looks so I'm not saying, look, I'm not being ignorant and I'm not saying all fat women are ugly. Y'all ain't, y'all ain't 10, so I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll say y'all, you know, in the middle there. So I'm going to go. Have a good one. Peace. For this and many other videos, check out my page. I'm sure you'll like that from internationals to MGTOW. Check my page. Out of focus.